During these loops through step four and step five, we've been opening a door, closing it, glancing at the memory. Metaphorically, we're just glancing into the room, catching whatever comes out. Eventually, the client's going to open the door on the memory and isn't going to be able to, from that particular metaphorical viewpoint, be able to tell what's distressing in the memory. It's at this point that we can walk into the room. We can open, you know, open up some cupboards. We can look under the couch cushions. We can look behind the couch. And we want to really clear out this memory, make sure that we're not leaving any distress in that memory. And the way we do it is we walk through one frame at a time a video of that memory. And it's now safe to do that now that most of the things that want to kind of jump out of the room have been resolved. Step six is a relatively quick process. I would say it probably takes five minutes or less in most cases. So the transition from step five is something like the following. At the, at the very end of step five, you're saying very quickly, open the door, close it, whatever's distressing. In this moment, catch it, contain it, push it out of your awareness. The client says, I can't find anything distressing right now. Good. And then we say, okay, now just flip through each frame of the memory one at a time from the beginning. And we're just looking for any leftover pieces of distress, even if it's a tiny bit. Let me know when you find the first piece of distress. Client lets me know, good. See whatever is distressing in this moment, go into your container. See the container close, push it out of your awareness, let me know when it's gone. It's gone, now we go back to step four. So now we're doing a loop between step four and step six, where we're checking this video and any distress is getting containered. And then we're immediately going into step four where we're going to do 30 seconds in the calm scene with our blinks every five seconds. After we do our blinks every five seconds, we return back to step six. And what we ask in step six, so the client was playing, they found this blip of distress. They let me know we containered it, pushed it out of awareness, did a round in the calm scene with blinks. Now we ask, is there any heat remaining in that part of the memory that just had distress a moment ago? Okay, that blip of distress, is there any heat left in it? A lot of the time, clients will tell you either no, and if they say no, you play the memory forward, or they'll say, yeah, it has a little bit. If it has even a little bit, scoop it up, contain it, push it out of your awareness, whatever it is, and then once it's gone, once it's gone, we um, we go right back into step four with calm scene and blinks. We just keep checking for distress in that last piece of activation until there isn't any. We play it forward. Say, so play that memory forward. Let me know as soon as you find the next link of distress. Got it? Good. Scoop that up. Contain it. Push it out of your awareness. Load up your calm scene. Let me know when you're there. Okay, so again, we're doing just loops and we're not done. So it will come, what often will happen, the client will play the memory, there'll be a blip. We'll catch it, contain it, push it out of awareness, do our calm scene, calm scene blinks. It's going to take a lot of heat out of that, whatever it is. It's either going to resolve it or partially resolve it. If it doesn't fully resolve it, you have new content to container. Otherwise, play the memory forward, blip. Process that blip until it's gone. Process the next blip until it's gone. Process, keep walking through that video until the client can play the whole video with no distress on any channel. When that happens, you're done. And I'm going to show you one whole step six in which we walk through, um, we walk through the video of the memory all the way up until the completion uh, of the reprocessing. And blink. Okay, go ahead. How'd that go? Good. Okay, very quickly, open, close, super quick. Whatever's distressing in this millisecond, catch it, contain it, push it out of your awareness. I'm trying to find some distress and I'm having a hard time finding it. Okay, so this, um, this memory, 
um, has has a kind of, can you find, you know, has a beginning and an end, mm -hmm. doesn't it? Okay, mm -hmm. good. Um, play it from the beginning very slowly and let me know either with your hand or with a nod when you find the first link of distress, the first little piece of distress, even if it's like a 0.5 out of 10. Okay. Play from the beginning really slowly. As soon as you find it, let me know. Found just a little bit. Okay, good. Scoop it up. See, go into your container, push it out of your awareness, whatever it is. Let me know when it's gone. Okay, good. Calm scene. Okay. Okay, good. Blink. Blink. <laughs> Blink. Blink. and blink. Okay, good. How did that go? Good. Good. That piece that just had distress a moment ago, is there still distress in it? Even if it's a tiny bit, check it and let me know. Mm -mm. Okay, good. Play no. the memory forward and let mm -hmm. me know if you find the next piece of distress. Got it. Good. Catch it, contain it, push it out of your awareness. If it showed up in your body, shout back it out. Let me know when it's gone. Okay. Okay. Good. Calm scene. Blink. 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 And blink. Okay, good. How did that go? <laughs> really good. <laughs> Excellent. Good. Um, very quickly, check the piece that just had distress. Is there any distress in that piece of the memory in this moment? No. Okay, good. Play the memory forward and let me know if you find the next piece of distress, even if it's a tiny bit. Got it. Okay, good. Scoop it up, contain it, push it out of your awareness. Let me know when it's gone. Okay. Good. Calm scene. Blink. 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 And blink. Okay, good. How'd that go? Good. Good. That piece that just had distress in it, is there any distress in it in this moment, even if it's a tiny bit? No. Okay, good. Play it forward. Play the memory forward. Let me know if you find any distress in any part of it. No distress. Okay. Good. So go back to the beginning, play it again, see if there's anything hiding under a cushion or hide, see if there's anything hiding anywhere. Um, and just let me know if you find something. Nope. Okay. Excellent. So we would um, 
we in in flash approaches we would consider that memory resolved 